All right, out here at uh, Seaside for the SCCs, walking with uh, Nick Kleinert, head uh, men's coach at Auburn, and uh, just talking a little bit of golf and getting his perspective on a few things. So when you're recruiting a kid, uh, other than scoring well, which is obvious, what are you looking for? You know, we look for everything, Mo. I mean, we're looking for how they handle adversity. Um, obviously, the academic component. Can they handle the classes and the academic curriculum that we have at Auburn University? And um, we're looking at how they, you know, compose themselves when they play, um, how they treat their parents, how they treat their golf clubs, how they treat their golf bags, um, their work ethic. You know, what time do they get the golf course to warm up? Are they stretching? Do they have a plan? Um, you know, just talking to a lot of different people, the guidance counselors, their head pros, um, the swing teachers, their sports psychologists, or fitness trainers, just trying to get to know them more about their character and integrity, um, just to know that they might be a good fit um, in college at, at different places. Okay. And then, so now they're at school, and then, you know, once they're there and, and you've got them, uh, what do you see the difference between ones that keep improving or the ones that either kind of stall out or even regress once I they're think, in college? That's a great question. I think it starts with having a plan. You know, the guys that have the most success and keep getting better and better every year have a great plan, and then it's up to them to execute that plan. Um, they're pretty time management skills are really good. They're pretty organized. Um, they kind of have their days planned ahead. And ultimately, they have a great mindset. You know, they, they, mentally, they're really strong. The fact that they, they, you know, they tell themselves the things they're good at. They're encouraging themselves. They're, they're, they hold themselves to a high standard. They're very demanding of themselves, but they're not demeaning to themselves. So I think a lot of it starts with mindset, organizational skills, and time management skills, especially in college. Okay, great. And then the ones that are not only to keep improving, but, and you've had a few of these that you've helped along the way, develop into the elite level of an All-American. What do you see in them? I think it ties back into the two. I mean, I think those guys are really disciplined with their time. They, they, they go through mental workouts. Um, they're getting better mentally, not just the physical component. Um, they're encouraging to themselves. At the end of the day, they're writing down things that they did well, maybe two or three things, always telling them things that they did, they did well that day, whether it be in life, workouts, um, golf, a variety of different things. But it ultimately comes down to having a great blueprint, great plan, being organized, managing your time, and listening to other people, listening to their coaches, listening to their support team, um, listening to their parents, and just continue to try to chip away and get better and better every year. All righty. Thank you very much.